Hi everyone, welcome to Craft and Crochet. In my previous video, I show how to crochet this so beautiful and so soft and really easy baby blanket. Then I have so many lovely comments and the 1 million views within 3 months. Thank you very much for everyone. Some of them asked me how to crochet this matching set. Then I made this matching hat with the same pattern. In this video, I'm going to show you how to crochet this baby shoes with the same pattern. I create these shoes by myself with the same pattern. I hope you will love it. I'm going to show you four different size with this same pattern. 0 to 3 month and 3 to 6 month and 6 to 9 and 9 to 12 month. Even beginners can follow this pattern too. If you know this pattern, you can create by yourself different shoes. And I hope you will love it. If you like this video, please thumbs up and share and comment down below. If you're new for my channel, don't forget to join with my thousand of subscribers by clicking this subscribe button and the bell icon. If you miss my previous video, please click on my channel name Craft and Crochet. Under this video icon, you can get my all previous video in here. This all videos with the subtitle too. Okay, let's get start. Okay, I create these shoes with the same pattern for Craft and Crochet. This shoes is 0 to 3 months. And if you know this pattern, you can create by yourself like these shoes. You can get this pattern in a Crochet for Life channel. In a Crochet for Life channel, I show how to crochet these four different size baby shoes. If you missed that, I give you a link down below. I'm going to make these shoes with a 0 to 3 month. And I'm going to give you four different size as well this is 0 to 3 and this size 2 and this is size 3 and this size 4 9 to 12 month this is the 0 to 3 month this both is 0 to 3 month size first i'm going to show you how to crochet this 0 to 3 month size i'm using double knitting yarn and the this recommend hook is the 4. This yarn ball have a 100 gram yarn. I'm going to use 4 millimeter crochet hook. I made this 4 different size with the same hook. I'm going to start this shoes with this, this part. You can see in here this part, black part. And I'm going to update this pattern in a Crochet for Life channel. And I'll give you a link down below. I'm using 4mm crochet hook. And I'm going to make this size 1. 0 to 3 month. To begin, slip knot. And chain 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7 chain, into the 7 chain, 3 double crochet, then I'm going to start with the 2 chain, 1, 2, this is the first double crochet, into the 7 chain, 2 more double crochet, 1 double crochet, and a two double crochet. Now I have a three double crochet into the next one, two, three, four, five, five chain, one double crochet, one, two, three. 
two. Three. Four. And a five. Now I have a five double crochet, one, two, three, four, five. Into this last double crochet, I'm gonna make six double crochet. One, two, three, four, five and a six now I have a six double crochet into this last chain next into the next five stitch I'm gonna make one double crochet one two three Three, four, and a five. Into this last chain again, three double crochet. Now you can see here I have a six double crochet and this chain have a six double crochet. Join with the second chain using by slip stitch. Now I have a 22 stitch for one round. Second round is start with the chain one into the next two stitch, two single crochet. Into this space, two single crochet. Into the next four stitch. Four single crochet. One, two, three, and a four. Into the next stitch, one half double crochet. You can see here I have a six double crochet. Into the each stitch, two double crochet. Sorry, two half double crochet. One is stitched to two do half double crochet. Second is stitched to two half double crochet. Into the third is stitch, two half double crochet. Into the fourth is stitch, two half double crochet. Into the five is stitch, two half double crochet. Into the six is stitch, two half double crochet. Now I have a 12 half double crochet for this 6 stitch. Next, into the next stitch, 1 half double crochet. Into the next 4 stitch, 4 single crochet. 1, 2, 3 and 4. Into the next three stitch, two single crochet. One, two, and three and four together. And five and six together. You can see in this side have a three double and this side have a two double with the one chain. Into this chain space, one single crochet. Then all together come in 12 single crochet. Join with the first chain using by slip stitch. Now I can cut this yarn. This is the size for 0 to 3 month. End of this second round, I have a 34 stitches. We need two of these. This is the 0 to 3 month.
now we have finished this part next I'm gonna make in this part this part I made with the 11 chain I made this to 0 to 3 month size 0 to 3 and 3 to 6 we need 11 chain you can see in here size 1 and size 2 need 11 chain size 3 and size 4 need 12 chain size 1 and size 2 need 11 chain and 3 and 4 need 12 chain 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 now i have 11 chain i turn this chain to the other side I skip first chain into the second chain one single crochet this first chain is the first single crochet this is the second single crochet three four five six seven eight nine ten this is the last chain and eleven single crochet now i have 11 single crochet second round is start with the chain one turn your work other side this chain one is the first single crochet into this each stitch i'm gonna make single crochet using by only back glue one two three four five six seven eight nine ten this is the last loop and eleven eleven single crochet turn chain one turn your work at the side again into this each stitch one single crochet using by only back glue this chain one is the first single crochet one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and eleven now i finished three round next round is start with again chain one turn your work at the side again into this each stitch one single crochet using by only back glue you can see in here i'm using this one and two size then i need 11 chain size three and four you need one more chain that mean 12 single crochet if you 
gonna make three to six month you need 36 round and three to six month 40 row and six to nine month 44 row nine to twelve month 48 row you can continue this single crochet with your size you can see in here this two row is coming one line i count this two row with the one line now i have a two line if you're gonna make size one you need 18 line and size 2 20 line size 3 22 line size 4 24 line i'm gonna make 0 to 3 months then i need 18 line now i'm nearly finished this 18 line 18 line mean 36 row you can see in here i'm finished 36 row this two is coming one line then i have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen eighteen line this is the zero to three month you can see in here have eighteen line This is the size for zero to three month. I'm going to show you this is the size one zero to three month. Size two, you can see in here. I show you in here. This one I made with the twelve chain with the twelve single crochet for the size three and four. Size 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 18. I'm going to mark in here 18 line. Then it's coming 9 inches. Size 2, 3 to 6 month. I'm going to add 2 more line. That means four more row then coming 10 inches this is the size 2 size 3 6 to 9 month then we need 44 row then 22 line then is coming 11 inches next 9 to 12 month 48 row with the 24 line then is coming 12 inches this the all size for this 0 to 12 month you can see it's the size 1 size 2 size 3 and size 4 we increase only two line for each size. Now I'm going to start my pattern for these shoes. I have 18 line. I'm going to make into this half. You can see in half. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 9 line into this line line i'm going to start this pattern this the pattern for these shoes you can see this pattern if you make the blanket and a hat you know this pattern now start with the chain one into the same space one single crochet and a chain three one two three 
into the same space 3 double crochet 1 2 and a 3 skip 2 stitch sorry 3 stitch into the 1 2 into the third stitch one single crochet and a chain three one two three again into the same space three double crochet one two and a three skip one two into the third a stitch one single crochet this is the pattern now I have a two pedal I need six pedal for this zero to three month into the same space three more double crochet Skip two stitch and into the third stitch one single crochet. Now I have a three. I need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Into this nine line, I need three more pedal. Now I am going to make last pedal into this 9 line, chain 3, 1, 2, 3, into the same space, 3 double crochet, into this 9 line, line 9 one single crochet we have a nine more line one two three four five six six pedal for this nine line second row start with the chain three into the single crochet one double crochet into this third double crochet one single crochet chain three into this chain space three double crochet one two and a three into this third double crochet front four single crochet with the chain three one two three into this chain space three double crochet into this third chain front four single crochet with the chain three this is the pattern for these shoes follow this pattern i'm going to show you how to in this second round into this third double crochet to front four single crochet with the chain three chain three space I'm gonna make three double crochet into this single crochet one single crochet next row start with the chain three and into this space one double crochet and into the third double crochet to front four single crochet with the chain three this chain is space to three double crochet into the third double crochet front four single crochet 
now I am finished. Sorry, I start third round. This is the pattern. We need five row for this shoes. If you make the blanket and a hat, you know this pattern. Now I am nearly finished round five. This is the last pedal for this round five. Three double crochet and finish with this third chain using by single crochet. This is the basic for this shoes. I finished five row with this same pattern. Now I have all basic parts for this shoes. I'm gonna join this first line and 18 line together. I'm gonna show you this the first line and this the 18 line. This two line I'm gonna join together using yarn needle and the same color yarn. I'm using this side two loops. You can see here two loops and other side one loop. First we need tight this yarn in here. Next, I'm going to use this stitch, this side both loop and other side back loop. Again, this side both loop, other side only back loop. I'm using this stitch to join this. two line together from now please follow this video This is the last chain, sorry, last single crochet. This last two single crochet. I join like this. You can see this really nice finishing. Now you can tie this yarn in here. And after you can hide this yarn, I'm going to use this line to hide this yarn. Hide the other rest of yarn with this same way. Now I finished the second parts for these shoes. Next we have to join these two parts together. It's coming this half double crochet for front. This the back I'm going to show you in here. It's coming like this. We have to use this right side for the out and this side for the in. We have to bend this part for like this and this corner is going to here and this side I am using different color yarn to showing you like this.
if you put like this together then an easy to stitch and this side is coming this top and this side and together I hope you can get it I'm gonna tie this both side for temporary like this then you can stitch nicely like this now I'm using yarn needle and same color yarn to join these both parts together I'm um, start with here. This is the second part. Now I'm using small stitches to join these two parts together. You can see in here I'm using small stitches you can see in here so clearly I'm using small stitches to around this I'm gonna show you in here like this from now please follow this video now I finish this side now I'm remove this yarn again I'm using small stitches to join this side you can stitch this side I'm going to show you how to finish in here you can see it's nice finishing now I'm gonna tie this yarn I tied this yarn and pass this yarn through this line Now I finish, I can cut this yarn. It's so simple. You can see this really good finishing and the really easy to make. Now I'm going to finish these shoes with this top. I'm using yarn needle and yarn to put this all nine line together I pass this needle like this through the each line I have a line 9 for this shoes front if you're gonna make size 2 you need 10 line if you're gonna make size 3 you need 11 line if you're gonna make size 4 you need 12 line
now I can tie this together and pull this to yarn like this it's really simple you can see this this the shoes now you can tie this together It's coming really nice and you can use the yarn needle to hide this to yarn from now please follow this video Now I finish this shoes with the matching pattern for the our blanket. I hope you will make two. You can share your finished product with the my Facebook page. I give you a link in the description down below. If you like this video, please thumbs up and share and comment down below. See you again with another video.